D.C. Um, right before the March for Life, and that is when they met each other in person for the first time. And I remember at the Snowflake Dance in Washington, D.C., where you have to pick random partners and switch them every 10 seconds, Lucas and Gigi tried to pick each other out for every single dance, and somebody actually had to yell at them because they kept trying to pick each other out of the crowd. The first time I met Lucas in person solidified that he was the person for Gigi. He looked at her with such love and admiration, and Gigi looked so happy and secure. I really was in awe of how happy they were together, and if I could share the mental picture I have of that day, I totally would. first met Gigi became the most herself that I ever saw her like she was laughing she was just so happy she was so open and like honest with you and it was just so awesome and you treated her so nice you were so respectful and kind and you guys spent every second together um you constantly told her how her hair smelled like strawberries <laughs> or you know crayons or something <laughs> Lucas, I see a, a young man who adores my daughter and treats her with kindness and respect. He was obviously raised to be compassionate, thoughtful, honest, and he's a classy guy all the way through. He's smart and articulate and humble and has a wonderful sense of humor. So what's to be apprehensive about? In Gigi, there always been a, there's always been a gentleness and, like her middle name, a beautiful grace. The word I use now when I describe her is often as winsome. But under that gentleness, there's also a fearlessness, as evidenced by her talent show performances that involve a ukulele and a hula hoop. I remember him never uh, not talking about her in all honesty. I would get the screenshot of conversations and what do I say to her? And all that kind of stuff. <laughs> all the time throughout high school. And it was honestly the cutest thing in the world. Um, and then I first met Gigi about four years ago once they started dating uh, over at uh, JP Catholic. I came up for a weekend and honestly, at the first uh, meeting, I thought she was a little too shy for him, honestly. She's always been a fairly outgoing person and 
always adventurous and at first I was a little hesitant but honestly since that day they have done nothing but bring out the best in each other and every single time I come down and visit and see them I only see more of that. I love you guys and that's all I want to say. You're very beautiful and I cannot wait to see what life gives you guys. To the bright and green. Both. And you guys are absolutely perfect for each other. And I wish you all the best. Cheers to the bride and groom. Cause I love